Now, pictures have been released of Hollywood actor Colin Firth on the set of new drama Lockerbie. Uh, but when it comes to making historical dramas, are they in poor taste or are they needed to educate the younger generation? Um, it's kind of fine line, I suppose, Jane, isn't it? Mm. Yeah, I think it depends on how they do it. Yeah. Um, you know, there are some dramas around events like this where you sort of feel it's a little bit voyeuristic and you sensationalist. Think? Yeah, I've seen a few over the years. Um, but I have high hopes for this one in particular. Um, first of all, I don't think Colin Firth would do it if he felt it was any of those things. Secondly, it's based on the story of Dr Jim Swire, whose daughter Fiona yeah. died um, in, in the crash and his fight for justice. And it's based on the book around that. So I feel he's going to be, obviously, Colin Firth playing yeah. him and he's going to be the narrative yeah. that runs through that. So I think it, it's going to be very solid on, on that front. Yeah. And, yeah, I mean, it's it's... It probably will be the first time that a lot of young people will have heard... It's 35 years ago, so it's the first time they will have heard I about it. I mean, it's, I mean, as it happens, all those years ago, um, I, I was a reporter... Sorry, on, Flora on, is the name Flora, of the Flora, yeah. Um, I was a reporter on the scene at, um, oh. at Lockerbie, and so I've been involved in a couple of events since oh, because of that. Um, and, and one quite recently, which was another documentary, which was also very well done, I have to say, but it was a documentary, not a drama. Um, and I was speaking to some of the people afterwards, you know, who worked on the production, who were sort of late 20s, early 30s, and they didn't know about Lockerbie, mm, what yeah. had happened in Lockerbie and the loss of life and the, mm. and the, the whole story. Uh, and they were fascinated and genuinely interested. But for me, it was such a moment because, you know, I was like 25 when it happened. And as I say, I was on the scene. So I've yeah. kind of it's been through my life. And to know that there's a new generation coming up who weren't aware of it, you know, was really striking, which makes me think, yeah, absolutely, Jane, done well, has to be done well. Mm. But it is important, isn't mm, it? Definitely. You know, that we remember. You know what? Windrush is one of yeah. the stories of recent years yeah. that I'm ashamed to say <clears throat> I wasn't aware of as much as I should have been mm. until it yeah. started to be covered in, in documentaries and dramas. And that is, that is a, I suppose, a part of it, why it is important for the information to be correct and to be given. Because although people might assume, many might think, oh, you know, Windrush is only about the black community, but there was many others from different cultures and backgrounds who remember that period, who married mm -hmm. to people that came off the Windrush, who worked with them. So it's also the British history as well. It's not just yep. the Caribbean, the West Indians, or, or the black community's history. It's our history. And that's why it's important for shows to be made. For me personally, there is particular shows that I find very hard to watch, especially over the last few years, um, when we look back at things like George Floyd and the pandemic. So certain trauma-based and very much black trauma-based, I can't watch and I make sure I protect my own mental health. And, and definitely with things like the show that's coming up, Lot B, I would be, I would make sure that I'm in the right frame of mind and I would suggest that to anybody because it is triggering. There's so much yeah. going on in the world and you might know someone who was affected by it. So just be mindful um, in anything that you're going to watch that could be a trigger, but it's also important to know what others have been through so that you can <clears throat> empathise yeah, and I mean, understand the, the, your history. Yeah, absolutely. It is the... Um, <clears throat> yeah, the power of television. You look at the Mr Bates versus the post office. Yeah, yeah. modern history. I mean, so mm. many people didn't know. I mean, that story's been going on for 20 years, I've been mean, trying to get <clears> justice, <throat> and it wasn't until they did it in a drama that everybody got mm. behind it. And, yeah. and, I I think, and I think, you know, we've got a perfect example at the moment, Zone of Interest International, Brit British film, won um, the Oscar for Best in International Film. Mm. And it's just looking at um, outfits from a completely different mm -hmm. angle. And there's a brilliant speech by Jonathan Glazer, the director, who just reminds us all to learn from history yeah. and to be mindful of what's gone on before. And I, I thought that was... It's a brilliant film. Really, really, I'd recommend anyone to see it. And I think I agree, when you're dealing with real trauma and real tragedy, it's really important that it doesn't just become a salacious, mm. voyeuristic need to look at other people's mm. pain and suffering. Yeah. I think there's much more of a responsibility, yeah. isn't there? Yeah. I, I have to say, for me, repeated. that's mm. where... I know a lot of people have got an interest in true mm -hmm. crime. I, mm. It's not my thing, particularly. I do worry about sometimes that crossing a line, that it becomes entertainment. Yeah, um, the Ted Bundy, Jane just reminded me who it was. The yeah. Ted Bundy, did you see that? I just felt like... Yeah. And there were so many victims still alive, it just yeah. felt... 
Whereas Certainly. these major events in, in history, yeah. you know, I think it's really important that they are treated with, yeah. with to respect. To engage people Which I think history. generally they are. Let's face it, a lot of history is taught in a really boring way at mm. school, isn't it? So if you're well, yeah. engaging people well, into it... My, my so kids have got into it. the crown, and I mean, I know, you know, it has its detractors, and I have to say I'm not particularly a fan, but, you know, they are both saying to me, oh, I didn't realise this, and I didn't realise that, and I went and did a search on the internet, and I found out this, and I thought, wow, actually, you know, them watching that and enjoying but They the searched drama. on the internet, that's the important thing, to make sure what was fact and yeah, what was... <laughs> but at least they're interested, <laughs> yeah. you know, I mean, yeah, they, they could have just let it go over their heads, so... It's all our know, history, isn't absolutely. it? Absolutely. Really?